What's up, everybody? We're here playing Slay the Spire right now. Let's do some downfall. We got some unlocks to get uh, finished here. Which ones? We want to do... Well, the ones that have two unlocks left... The Sneko is the only one that has two unlocks left. Fine. We'll do it. We get some trinkets. If you do it. Uh, so the Sneko is a, a unique boss. We get to pick from, like, different pools that we're gonna see or something like that. Unidentified cards can become hermit cards. So there's are unidentified cards that can happen. Uh, hermit cards are, like, you want to get cards in the middle. Uh, of the deck because then they give you special things um, There's also a lot of cards that give you curses. There's a lot of cards that give you status effects that are negative Guardian runs the guardian is the guy that ooh puts things into stasis I think so that snake would gain stasis Could be good Considering the randomized costs of everything that stasis would guarantee that when they pop out they are free to play We'll try Guardian there. Defect cards. Exaghost cards. Exaghost gives you this, like, this big thing of all the different spaces. I don't think Hexaghost would work very well, but defect then. Champ or silent cards. So we'll try silent. Start off with a pretty standard deck here. There's a lot of card, uh, things that will muddle cards. There's a way that we can actually lock in unidentified cards. Um, I feel like the volume is not very loud. Should we have Monster Cat music? Or should we do uh, in-game Slay the Spire? 24 damage for a 16 max. Um, Neo's Lament. Upgrade a card. Boss Relic. Right now we have Sneko Soul. The first time you play an off-class card, gain energy and draw a card. That's pretty good. Vampire music. Monster Cat, Monster Cat. Loving the EDM vibes. Okay. I think max HP could be really good here. Let's do that. Um, pretty strong. So, like, if we really wanted to fight two elites in a row, it's possible that we live through that. It's possible that if we don't want to do that, we can go to the right here. Fire, fire, fire. Shop. That one's pretty good. Double shop on the right. Let's do it. Upgrade some of these cards. Tail whip, 13 damage, 1 to 2 weak, 1 to 2 vulnerable. Could upgrade the unknown cards too. Muddle the two highest cards in your hand, maybe snack bite. Some of the cards have a, a thing where they can't be changed, the price of them. Read Void's message. Guardian braces and activates defense mode. Shield and Temp Thorns. Got it. There's a silent card. Do that on you. Oh, off class card, gain energy and draw a card. Right, 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 right. Almost already forgot. But that's a block. Okay, maybe that's a little too loud now. Let's... We got Twin Slam here. Gain a second slam after I slam him, but it only does six damage. We can muddle this Tail Whip. Costs one now, but the strike costs three. Ooh, vulnerable. Nice. There's no stasis. Well, it's too late. Deal 9 damage, gain a random off-class attack, and muddle it. Rotation. Snack proof. That's the thing where you can't change the uh, cost. Can't be muddled. Can't be changed by confusion. Discard all off-class cards. Draw that many cards. Or a random block card. Um... I'm open for improvised attack. 
Early shop might be a mistake. You actually have to fight the shopkeeper. So it's it's Slay the Spire, but this is the mod. It's called Downfall. Instead of going up, you go down. You are a boss and you go back to kill the heroes. Basically, the ro roles are all reversed. We have to fight through the shop and try to kill the shopkeeper. The shopkeeper tries to hurt me and run away with my with my stuff. It does, you know, it's a thing. Hail Whip went more expensive. Two damage to random enemy four times. We just gotta try to kill this guy. Like I said, he's gonna attack me. He's gonna steal my shit. So we can't have orbs here. Still get the orbs. Sorry, morbs. Boss got impatient and decided to go for the hero. Oh, it's horrible. Place a random card to your hand into stasis. Basically, when Void tells you something, go with the opposite. Go the other way. Directly opposite. If I dual cast, is that going to dual cast my defend? I can almost pretty much afford everything. Else. Send it. Yeah. We got 40 damage. What the heck is Void? Two off. Gain two random off class cards. So let's just go. Let's do it. More the merrier, right? Uh, I would really like to have artifact and bird faced urn. We just. It, it steals our stuff, so. Unidentified uncommon power sounds nice. Guardian wheel. Mm. Let's go with the power card. So it looks like our orb slots are sharing between stasis and orbs. Uh, it's an interesting one for sure. Maybe we just kill him. All right. Or maybe not. Cold snap. Capacitor. Snack bite. You want these for free? Yeah. Unidentified weak card. Something that applies weak. Dice Crush, 10 to 16 damage. Snake Sap, Snake Proof, deal 1 to 3 damage, gain 1 to 3 energy. I really like Snake Sap. I'm gonna take that. I'm gonna grab that one. Got some Feety Feats. That's a good one. I like it. Got some random cards. Okay, okay, okay. If I had upgraded Curl Up, I wouldn't mind that. Because we could choose what we put up there. I want Tail Whip or Leg Sweep to go up there. You're a dog. You're a Wiener. Nice poison stab for free. Probably just gonna defend snack bite, see if I can get one of these for free. Yeah. Hi, Bots. How are you doing today? Uh, I'm feeling pretty good. Chat, what do you think about this? Confused by any of the stuff that's happening right now? Eight block, random off class skill and muddle it. We could just go crazy. Deal 7 to 12 damage to all enemies. Upgrade all off class cards in your hand. If it was cheaper, I'd. Well. Improvised guard. I'm only a little confused. We could lock in. Ooh, we can lock in Feety Feats. Do dexterity. Nice. It's really. It's a nice power. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna lock it in. Instead of upgrading anything or healing. 
We're going through all the fires though. We should be able to keep going. Snack sap, maybe. Upgrade that tail whip so I guarantee weak and vulnerable. Ron scales. At the very least, he's kind of the most uninteresting. Snack? <gasps> oh, I thought we were done. We leveled up. You know, I really don't have to stand on the thing that's going to give me experience. I mean, I, I could, I guess I could go over here and, and grab some of these bags of cash. I mean, okay, fine. That's the one positive part is that when we come back, we can actually grab the cash from all of these candelabras that are broken. Gold fever. I got a fever. Look at how many freaking reapers there are. Holy frick. $23. Bruh. 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 Anyways. Back to it. Oh, that was the block one. Okay. I got a fever, and the only cure is more cowbell. You know, I thought this Sneko soul was every single time, every turn. It's only the first time per combat, so it's actually less good. This card. Uh, yeah, we could do that. A voice is in my head. Damn you, Stasis Strike. If I fall tonight, you can bring me back tonight. This is Saving Light Intercom Remix. Nothing. Don't want it. These are these are sucky. A lot of suck in that one. And be locked that in. Let's make it a little bit better. Let's take the heal. Oh, oh, yeah. Girl, damn, uh. Snacky boy. Gain energy if you have a card in stasis. I have a, uh, an orb. That didn't count. Nope. Snack proof. Exhaust a card. Gain a random card of the same class. Soul roll. Snack proof. Muddle your hand. So just randomize the cost of everything. Snack proof. Discard your hand. Draw five to ten cards. Restock, probably. It sounds really good. I thought I was supposed to start confused, but I guess that's not a thing. I'm hidden here again. A poor guy that skipped the vamp vod. While in defensive mode, raise your strength by two at the start of your turn. Brace five. We do get brace. But there's no, like, brace countdown. In five block, brace three. Put the card of yours into stasis. Well, that's just not going to work. Here it go. Oh. Restock.
Unite. More stasis, maybe. Ooh, good one. Twenty five counter. Armor's tincture, go. Only if you have the Sneko's eye, yeah, we need it. That sounds like it'd be fun. A lot of block. What happens if you kill the merchant? You get all the souls that he's stolen from you, plus more. Um, and then the shop appears normally. That sucks. Do better. Doesn't matter now. Eh, eh. Doesn't get up and walk away. Uncommon power again. Go. I like power cards. Become confused. Draw an additional card each turn. You only get that with the snack a lie. Mr. Bones. It would have been so funny if Void had said that instead. <laughs> okay, Hots, I see how it is. In two stasis slots. Crouch. We should probably try to muddle it. Something like that, I don't know. Let's do all the cheap ones. But I don't like EDM. Crunch. Thresh to treasure. Snack proof. Exhaust the card and gain energy equal to its cost. That could be good. Especially if it's like a really bad card that costs a lot. Draw card could also be really, really good too, though. Since... That's maybe like where we're like, like drawing more cards just seems like the way to go. Oh, trash. We'll try the trash to treasure. I don't think I've ever taken it. Special thing here. It has a pet leech. No, what is it? Hermit's card get bonus dead on effects while he is concentrated. Deal 10 more unblocked damage to break his concentration. Okay. Just have to break the concentration. Otherwise, he gets the dead on effects. Which makes this do 16 instead of 8. But I do want to kill this guy before it gains too much... Um... Stuff. This was like 9 damage, so we kind of bunged it up already. Mostly block it all, though. Start of your turn, gain Orb Slam. Hmm. I don't like all that stuff that's coming in. Tail whip yet. That's floating orbs. Improvised attack. 
Master Eye, I mean. Improvised attack. Trash to treasure that choke. Boom. Did nothing. <laughs> it's cool though. Bam, 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 bam. Get that foot loose. Orb slam. Start of your turn at a random common card, maybe. Oh, uh, yeah, shit. Oh, what a good, what a good reroll. We need more of those cards. Restock. Five to ten flipping cards. Flip me in right in my flip hole. Check your vampy. 93 minutes. How many Reapers is that? 63 Reapers. Oh, Rough House coming in. If I can break his concentration, he won't get any block, but it'll still do 18 damage to me. This is good. That's good. This is fine. Oh, gosh. We have to hit him unblocked. Snake Rake. This is pretty good. Draw zero to two cards and muddle the highest cost card in your hand. Uh, much different. I'm built different. Get, keep that vulnerable up. That's good. 7 12 damage to all enemies. Upgrade all off class cards in your hands. That's maybe worth it early. Uh. Uh. Uh huh. Uh. Yeah. Love it. I love it. Why do I have an unidentified card in my hand? It's supposed to have identified it. This is the hello world. It got confused. It gave me an unidentified... That doesn't make any sense. You have to know... I. What is it? Huh? Also, look at this survivor floating next to two lightnings. I mean, that... What is going on? What's it happening? Use it. Oh, okay, there we go. It just it just identifies it like that. It's quite weird. This guy's already dead though. That was good. Rare power. Unending supply. At the start of each turn, gain a random off-class card. Glittering Gambit. Snack proof. Gain 10... Minus 10 to 30 souls. Tat, what do you think? Random power could be crazy. Unending, Cesaria Freeze. Go for all the money and just buy everything in the shop. Think of all of the artifacts we could get from the shop. Chat. Power or unending. I'm going money. Nobody actually wanted the money. Money actually, Cesaria. I'm thinking if I can buy like every single trinket or artifact in the shop, that that would be more powerful. Upon pickup, choose one of three unidentified character cards, add five copies of it to your deck. 
all combat drop an additional card reward of the chosen character's cards. Holy shit. Transform strike and defense though, that could be fun. Then there's the house. Unidentified guardian, defect, or silent. Silent. Finally beat the boss of Rogue Legacy 2 got delayed because of me moving out, but damn, what a game. Rogue Legacy 2 is fun, for sure. Look at all these question mark cards. Tempting, 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 but... I try to catch this fire here, so I'm gonna go like... Zipping. Lock an unidentified card into a permanent card. What do we got? The floating orbs, is, that was pretty good. Nightmare? Um, I like Nightmare a lot. I'd lock that in. Any high cost cards are gonna be really good because we're gonna muddle them anyway, so we can get Nightmare for really cheap. Add three copies of a card that costs zero. I'm in. Problem with so many random cards though is the potential to get cards that don't allow me to block. And we're just kinda shit out of luck. Plus 10. Random potion? That's pretty good. Um, Nightmare did not get muddled, but that would have been funny to, to Nightmare the money or Nightmare the Alchemist. That would have been, like, pretty dope. Let's trash the treasure this Nightmare, then, since it didn't get muddled properly, at least. Four cards. Next turn, draw two less. You son of a bitch, I'm in. Snake sap, give me more energy. Nope. <laughs> uh, <laughs> Glass knife, I gotta use some damage here. Right, I gotta do something. Nightmare keeps the cost of whatever it copies. Oh, this blows. Not go oil, please. Oh, it didn't reconfuse me. It just kind of kept the price of all this bullshit. Self repair, maybe. Don't have anything to cast. Maybe block. Hmm. Hmm. I don't know. I could muddle things with the snack bite. YOLO it. Nope. Negative. <clears throat> One health, two. Sure, 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 yeah, 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 it did random the first couple cards. It didn't look like it. They looked like they were the same. This guy's gonna get away. Nope. It's shielded and then it's back into a, a, a back to attack. Like an idiot. Like a big stupid dumb. It wants more. Wait, what? Did I use all my energy? Because that card didn't attack at all. Nah. More soul draw. I like it. We have a lot of off-class cards, though. Wide Sting could be good. 
Serpent Idol. Choose one of three random off-class cards to gain. It costs zero this turn. That was Wide Sting. We really need to figure out how to start with Master Eye. And just look at that card, please. Yeah. I need to make that innate. Mate. Six energy. Eviscerate. A school. Next turn, your attack deals double damage. Probably. Transform all off-class cards in your hand. Lose 8 HP. Gain a reward. Punch him. Upgrade, remove, remove card, and upgrade random card. Let's remove a card, upgrade random cards, remove a strike. Upgrade one of the basic cards. Okay, fine. Don't upgrade cards to zero. Mins of makes them worse with master. Huh? Didn't catch that fully. Nothing. They did nothing. Not nightmares. It's just not. It's not where I want it. Not how I want it. Could upgrade it. Didn't burk. Trash the strike and then nightmare the zap. Terror is nice. Oh, but I'm, I'm hexed. Maybe I just don't care. Ask me, Mama. Zap, zap, zap. Yeah, see, we got him. More feet work. No. Order Drake, five months. What's up? Welcome back. Thanks, Haley, for the ad bits. Appreciate you. Terrors. Phantasmal. Maybe. Is it worth it? It might be worth it. Terror is amazing. So is Phantasmal, right? They're both good. I pick one. Psych, I can do both. Idiot. <laughs> Send it. And 12 block. Four temporary thorns if in defensive mode. Otherwise, brace eight. Well, it's not really... It's good. Not, not doing much. I would have had that. When it was attacking. That would have been great. You already have a Phantasmal. You're right. Got two now. For a second there, I thought that the Phantasmal was... The other thing. But it wasn't... Cool talk, right? Mm, Lays, probably. I need to start attacking, though. I need to kill this guy. That's good. Definitely this. 
It's definitely that. Plus eight souls. Too bad. We got time to kill him, though. There's, there's more time. Calculate Gamble could be pretty okay if we really don't like what we have, but the zero-cost cards are dumb. I don't want them. I want really, really high-cost cards. I want some big stuff right now. Number fourth room is a treasure room. That's pretty good. Corpse explosion. Pretty good. Exploit gems is actually trash. Oh, though, look at that. Like this, I like that. Let's restock it. Get some snake sap in there. Still don't have any. Of, of, oh, there, there's a block. Yeah, there we go. And with that block, I say we phantasmal. You're a snake with legs. Yeah, you know what the uh, technical term for that is? The morb. I could have wide stung, but block potion, go. Salamander? Salamorber? Plus eight souls. That's a pricey terror. Probably worth it. Clearly, you are a frog. Hmm. Taking a little bit of heat here. More than I'd like. Improvise that guard, though. Waste the expertise. Upgrade them with wide sting, maybe. Thresh the treasure. Take that, Chaos. Oh, he's almost dead. Seems to me like getting confused was a mistake, says Mr. Bones. <laughs> maybe. Boop. Getting the singing bowl when you have two card picks per turn. At the start of your turn, reduce the cost of the highest off class card in your hand by one. Go. I like this though, too. Book of Stabbing with five regenerate. Ah, uh, crap. Muddle. Will I nightmare one of these? Improvise attack, I guess. Weaken them.
Damn you, Terror. Which is always more work than I'm willing to put into a run to min-max it. Kinda hate the confused mechanic, but for some upper-level Slay the Spire streamers, it's apparently very good. I think it's very good. We're not doing well right now. Granted. Twenty-one souls. RNG is not with us. That's all I'm gonna say. Sorry, Steven. You're hurting my face. Uh, are we dead? We're pretty much dead. We're pretty much dead. Every one of your defense costs three. The problem was getting the random cards. I think that was the mistake. That identified silent cards. We didn't really get a good balance of block and attack. We got a bunch of poo. Eight. Ten to eighteen. Just can't do it. Just physically can't do it. Uh, yeah. Finally getting that block and downfall is a challenge. Block fucked us over, like, to the max. Gremlin cards, that could be interesting. Although, it, I don't think that would really work if you had all those cards where it's like, switch to this guy. You don't have that guy, there's no other guy. We'll try it, we'll see what happens. Ironclad, champ. Cursed rare relic, go. Normal enemies drop an additional card reward. Do, 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 Hey. Do, 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 This looks exactly the same as the last one. Berserker Shout or Berserker Shout? Yes, that's... Ooh, I love that. Uh-huh. How's Vampire Survivors going? Great. 110 minutes. How about this clumsy? There go. We got pooped on. Done got pooped on. Defensive mode. Is there such thing as defensive mode? Looks like it. Hey. We counter when we use um a skill. Got a skill bonus it's called. We'll Berserker now if we wanted to. I'll tail whip ya. Weaken you, perfect. And then I guess just get a little bit of block off. So the first time he attacks, we'll do 13 back. So I retaliate. Do do do. Hey, bye. Will Vampire stop itself at a time? I don't think so. Unidentified exhaust card. Snack beam. Deal damage to all enemies equal to the number of unidentified cards in your deck. Doesn't sound very good. It's just two right now. I was going here so that we could remove that one card. Master Eye.
It's probably bad right now. Oops. Because everything that we have is like one cost. And it, it's only going to be costing more. Probably. But whatever. You can't tell me what to do. I really think that the essence of the snack is to use that card. Don't, says Ian. Little snack rake. 3 to 8 damage, 3 to 8 block. That's actually pretty cheap. It's not snack proof, though. We're getting so boned on the muddling. It's insane. I've never had this bad of luck. Unidentified colorless boss card. It's really nice. So is Snake Sap. Exhausted card. Gain a random card of the same class. Snake proof. Guard. The guard was pretty good last time when we were using it. But the random off-class card. I wish it was a random off-class block card. We'll go draw a card here. Considering we're going to try to spice it up with the confusion again. And there's three fires this way. Best I got. Other than that, I go fire, fire, elite. Or fire, fire, not boss elite. But I do like the idea of chipping away at that shop. Chrono Boost is pretty okay. One strength for every 12 cards you play, but... Upgraded boss card, upgraded master eye, maybe? Plus one card draw perk. I mean, that's kind of a big deal. Upgraded boss, go. Offering. Lose six HP, gain energy, and draw three cards. Go. Horrible. I hated all of it. Take it back. No luck in the muddling department. Free slime, though. Hey, you gotta look at the benefits here. this character I always die lol every time I play this character minus the time that you just saw I have like the most amazing ridiculous confusion crazy kill everything slaughter the entire planet fucking tear the entire world asunder run and now I'm like eh. fart in your general direction does it matter what we use here have you gotten any gremlin cards? Not that I've seen. In two turns, deal six damage to a random enemy six times. Scales of strength. Nah. Hey, how about some block? Crazy idea. What if... You gave me block? Interesting. Tell me more. Mm-hmm. Ooh, that's a... Oh, that's really good. Thank, thank you for that. Yeah. Oh, good. Ain't lucky. Cards that choose a random number as part of their card text choose the maximum possible number. So 10 to 16 would be 16. Browse Gene, thank you so much for the nine months, butt baby. Think bonk, butt baby time. Did I ever call out Order Drake? I think I did.
Scrap entitled, we'll try it. Snack about that. Uh. Oh, actually did gain one energy there. I forgot because of the Sneko Soul. Okay, Soul Roll. We just gotta, we gotta put a bunch of Soul Rolls in there. And here's what we're gonna do with that Soul Roll. We're gonna go ahead and roll over and die. No. Let me enter a skill stance. Nope. Probably the block at this point in time. soul roll this and we can possibly get some for different prices here see look you thought this was bad you just wait it gets worse that was nice Baish. Any plans to try other mods in this game? Slash Gungeon? No doll. Uh, maybe. Snack proof bleeding. Choose a card. What's bleeding? Card purges it and is removed from your deck. Choose a card which started on unidentified and identify it. Oh, interesting. Yeah. The reason I don't like Sneko is that other boss cards feel very narrow compared to the base game cards, so getting one-off boss cards as Sneko feels kind of bad. Uh... Sneck proof the Serpent Idol. If I could upgrade both of them, I think that'd be pretty okay. Boom, 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 boom. Soul rolls are good, though, too. And we're a concert. Look at that. Look at that. Fairy Dust. Gained two wards, and there's a, a Gremlins card. Two wards and draw two cards. Let's get rid of one of these defense. Move all debuffs, gain one strength. If you're below half HP, heal 10, gain two. I just don't even want these in our deck. 30 soul burn. We should have gotten them. Too late. Go through damage this turn. Your skill bonuses are safe. Facts are increased by two. Anger. Trigger your current skill bonus four times. We're defensive mode, so we'll get uh, more retaliate. That's, that's good. Do I just dice block or do I YOLO snake rake it? Go! Yeah. No. See upside down. Zoom, what do we have in our grave? Trash. Bunch of garbage. Trixie then.
didn't know this was the 24 hour stream. We're gonna go until Vampire Survivors gives up. Is that almost 90 frickin' uh, Reapers? Ninety reapers. All right. This is lame. Should we just go Yolo muddle? No, highest cost is only gonna give me a defender or a defense. Let's just hit him. That's it. Only have eighty-one souls. Oh no, I want it. Remove some of these one cost crappy cards? Probably. <laughs> 60 at one hour, 30 min right. One per minute, minus 30, right? Eight plated armor, that's nice. I'll try to muddle it for cheaper too, if I wanted to. Draw one card, put a card from your hand on top of your draw pile. You're a dog, I hate you. Reaper rave. Whenever you apply debuff to an enemy, gain two temp HP. Deal eight damage to all enemies, gain one whiz for anyone that attacks. Thunderclap. I don't think we. Oh, we do apply some debuffs, I guess. We could try it. With this bash. Get rid of this. Bash him. Got two temp HP. It's like a block that doesn't go away. Transmogrify. Choose one of two relics to lose. Obtain a random relic of the same rarity. I've never seen that before in my life. I'm going to try it. I could get rid of the spirit poop. I could throw the spirit poop back at the spirits. Finisher, we don't, we have to be in a stance in order to get finisher. Enter Berserk. Curve from your discard pile on top of your drop pile, maybe. He blocked it, that son of a bitch. He had uh, an artifact. Yeah. Clockwork souvenir, you're a douche. Gonna use buffer too. Let's get him with some soul burn. One of the longest runs on Reddit is 460 minutes, so probably not a record run. Like did they stop after 460 minutes? Cause I can go to bed like this, I'm fine. I always forget to use my potions. If I just leave it on overnight, it'll literally be a record run. Potions are so necessary, no, don't, don't forget that. Transmogrify, choose. Well, it's a one of two relics though, so it's... It's not even gonna give me the poop, you little shit. Turd? Turd you. Every 10 attacks gain energy or two card drops. Nunchaka. We got Umamori.
do 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 I get that red of karma. Cash them in at the nearest Coinbase shop. Oh, we've got voided. We need some block. Steal all artifact. A wish. Yeah. Looks like we're gonna take some damage. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. Tail whip, I hate you. What do? Bing, 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 bing. At least we don't have to get smacked by defect balls. Oh shit. Tail whip, make them weak. Now what, though? I mean... Get some block in there. There we go. Block it up. Block it up. Oh, yeah. We're gonna win. <laughs> you thought this was bad. God, he does have balls. You have balls. I like balls. Easy. More transmogrify? I don't, I don't, I can't. Deal none damage. Repeat this for each off cost card in your hand. Then exhaust those cards. I hate, I hate it all. You just transmogrify the shit out of all of our relics. Flipping game bit again? I guess, I, I hate all of the other stuff. Leaf drop an additional relic. No longer rest. Slaves call her, I guess, slavers. Hate everything that just happened uh, during that boss fight. That is a load of bunghole. Huh. Not seeing too many good spots to go. I hate this map. Get the shop up, I guess, here. Do -do -do. Do -do. Trash your treasure just doesn't exhaust if you upgrade it. Soul roll draws a card. Putting Gambit makes that you can't lose. Transmogrify could be free. Sure. <laughs> get him if I carnage him. Might be able to kill him. I'll go ahead and carnage. Close. Finish you.
got off work. Notice someone gifted me a sub. Thank you to whomever it was. Some generous people. For sure. You're the worst. Made it more expensive. What, what are the actual odds of that happening? Zero money. Just, I think it just keeps getting better. Slaver's Collar. We get random. You know, it's not bad. But. But, 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 boink. Runic Pyramid. Uh, maybe, maybe with the soul roll. I could see that work. I could see that. Yeah, thing. Can't draw a card, so if I snake rake, it'd be silly. There we go. Block card. Can't complain about not getting blocked and then pass up a block card. Herds. Herds. I think we're on uh, aggressive, so a defensive combo wouldn't work. Yay. I don't think it's going to allow me to reroll the spirit poop. Umamori, go. Ceramic fish. Whenever you add a card to your deck, gain nine gold. Hmm. Soul roll first. Yeah. No money. That I'm noticing. Kind of trash so far. Got more expensive again. Less expensive now. It's too late for it to really matter, but sure. Your luck here has been truly awful. I'm working my buns off here. Bambi card. Master Eye just allows me to get more cards per turn. That sounds like it's pretty okay. Even if you already have one. You know what I mean? We could also get quick move. Yeah. We can go this way. Fire. Elite. Fire. Or we can go this way. Fire. Shop. Super Elite. Fire. You know, let's veer off. Let's do it. For temporary strength. Okay. Offering. Energy and draw cards. Start of your turn. Gain award was a block. Exhaust all non-tack cards in your hand. Gain five block. No. Offer and go. Trash to treasure on me. I like the tail whip, but... You don't need the block right now. Double fire super elite might be good. Broken charm might be nice. A 17 souls. 
muddle that slime crush. It's weak, but we should probably attack it just because it's vulnerable. You can get rid of it. Ooh, that's what I'm talking about. We bash somebody first. That's what I'm talking about. Ice cream runic pyramid. I think that we should just get rid of that card all together. We should just throw transmogrify in the trash. I don't need it. How are we still going to take damage here? Oh, yeah, okay, we got him. We got him. We got him. Truly, truly, baby. The stream has gone well. Pretty good so far. Double check on that Vampire Survivor's run. Still looking really good. Operating off cards isn't going to do much here with Wide Sting. But once again, we just don't have any block. No block. Six block? Two weak, maybe, is more meaningful than six block. Ended up taking six damage off the top, plus it'll be less damage next turn. We shouldn't use car or energy if we don't have to use energy. Dude. The fact that this enemy, the snake plant, is not a fucking mini boss is just it it blows my mind. Mind blown. The toughest piece of shit ever! I can't. I can't do it. I can't fight this guy. You got me. GG. It's insane. Sometimes it kills you without even trying. It literally pumps out like 7 billion damage per turn. And then it just it hits you with this bullshit. It's the most powerful a second level enemy bar none makes zero sense thanks I hate all of it you're just not even gonna Give me... Oh, man. I could have... I could have gained three strength. <sighs> You're telling me... There's no attack cards. You're telling me... Okay. Strength. There we go. Got him. Gain ten block. Increased by two for each off class card in your hand. Ten's pretty good. Pretty good number. Requires a high def or high DPS run. Can't be in the middle or you lose. Transform card. We don't have Uma Mora anymore. Which one do we hate? Ooh, yes. Get rid of you. Although we could get a bunch of trinkets 
or artifacts, but if it ever pit my runic pyramid against my ice cream, we'd have to pick one, I think. I don't know if there was a cancel button, but let's send it and just turn it into a random call of this guy. Okay. Call of this could be good. Yeah, maybe. Every time we fight this guy, it's going to do five more damage. Just, could you not just give me absolute shit all the time? What is up with this? At least we get to save the energy. We're good. Ice cream, we're cool. We're cool, you're cool. pretty good here because he's gonna hit us five times uh. jack shuckle thanks for the six months Woo. welcome back bing 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 mother flipping bingy bingy bing 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 ice cream really helps out with all of the muddling shield throw if we can get some block might just soul roll it though Trish. Absolute Trish. Almost got him. Could have maybe used my liquid memories, but. I just honestly, I want to get more soul rolls. Is that too much to ask for? Where's my soul roll? I need more of that. Remove something like a strike card. Get an unidentified power card. Remove a strike. The doggo's still going. Still going strong. Like a champ. If I last stand, I'd probably get rid of my confusion. Right? Or should I just block? Devastate. Deal six damage, three. Oh, it's a finisher, though. <laughs> I'm not in a stance. Mm, son of a. Gain two strength. Enemies gain one strength. Do we have any stance cards on us right now? No. No, no yes. Defensive shout. We could take it and muddle it. Never gonna cost anything more than three. I suppose. is a boss deal two deal damage two more times if not stun it i like that you can also get pin pricks here but they're gonna be muddled stunned your dick Sh 
Pick it. You know, we muddled it, but then it went back to five. So if we were to trash to treasure this, boom, five extra energy to work with here. Early wild, wide sting. Yes, please. Oh, we didn't have any off suit cards, so nothing got upgraded. Sure, okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. My hand is full. Wish me luck. Plus three strength goblins. Gremlins. Oh my god, oh my god. Flesh of steel. Honestly, keep the soul roll for the next turn. Saxi Asparagus, 33 months. This makes me feel old. Welcome back. Yeah, this is bad. That is pretty bad. That's a lot of damage coming in. Oh my God is right. Better. Oh, you know what? I don't actually have a combo at all. I don't have a stance. Freaking champ cards are just actually terrible. Locked 15 damage with that. We got two energy here. I guess I could get my ghostly armor back. I think that's 18 damage. Let's say I just killed a little guy. Not enough block. Not enough, but. <sighs> Take out the little guy. Maybe. Crash that. Three strength. Kill this guy. Or not. Horrible. That's so bad. How could you be so bad? This is actually the worst Sneko, the, the two worst Sneko runs I've ever had in my life. Hands down. I don't know who I angered. I don't get it. I don't want to focus so much on the little guys, but it stops the big guy from fighting. I just don't understand what kind of, like, choices I have right now. Probably could have bashed him, I suppose. Do I want to go get this guy, though? I don't know. 
gotta do something about everything else. Let's say 10 to 30 souls and gave him two. No, it says negative 10 to 30 souls. See, now if I would have killed this guy, he probably wouldn't have done 45 damage. We're fine. We're fine. We're fine. We're fine. Gotta finish this motherfucking shit, yeah. Got him. Plus one strength. So I gotta go with the soul roll. Getting an extra card per turn is super nice, but the soul rolls saved my life. Sleep it off. This fight, this is a tough one too. This is a really tough one. Plated armor here. Get some block. You got tired eyes. Seems like it has a lot of cards. Come with this guy. I've lost 15 runs in a row. This game hates me. Play the Spire sort of started the deck builder revival. There's a revival? Did it ever go away? The standard block or Serpent's Idol YOLO. Ah, we block all of it. We do this. And we get the counter too because we're defensive. Trash to treasure, probably, on the most expensive one. Snack bite, the tail whip. Perfect. Him too vulnerable, too vulnerable. Enter defensive, gain nine block, increased by vigor. Don't have any vigor, but just use it. Yeah. We have one strength, so this would be 17 damage. Hard draw is good. Get him. Let's finish him. Soul roll. Yes. Roll my soul. Pride. At the end of your turn, put a copy of this card on top of your draw pile. Yuck. Souls for HP? No, I don't want any of that. Mm -mm. When you get a bad question mark, it's just like... Snake plants. Oh, boy. With two soul rolls. Yeah, buddy. That'll be fun. The fucking snake plant. What do? I 
I guess. Could have wide stung it maybe first. I want to ride my bicycle. I want to ride my bike. I want to ride my bicycle. I want to ride it where I like. Double my block. Give me some block first. Don't have any block. No one's got block. Negative on the blocking. Snake rake my good instincts. Twelve block, twelve counter, one blur. Yeah, there we go. Guardian wheel and right in the dick. Another soul roll? How many soul rolls is too many? So power potion here. Whenever you play an off-fast card, draw one card. Whenever you muddle a card, gain two block. Ooh, I like these a lot. Go mud shield. And when you soul roll the whole thing, we just block, 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 block. Quite nice, really. What's your deal? We should read that first. When the Watcher loses 150 more HP, apply minus four strength to her when she en next enters Divinity or plays Ragnarok. Okay, just nonchalantly gonna drop Ragnarok in there. Yeah, end of the world. Might happen, but you know, you got it. with some vulnerable maybe not right now maybe not yet actually this be defensive let's soul roll this tail whip I'm tired of looking at it look at all that block that we're getting this glorious god the soul rolls are good man we need that mud uh whatever thing Mud shields. We sorely need that in our deck. Let's wait on that. My hand is full. 18 damage. Three damage to all enemies two times. Gain two wards. Swap to shield of gremlin. We'll go blood for blood. Point some damage. Do another serpent's idol. So three additional damage to weakened enemies. Gain six block, three temp thorns. Your HP cannot be reduced until your next turn exhaust. Let me go target wounds here. More damage to weakened enemies. We weaken, I think, really only from our tail whip, but we do have a tail whip. We have too many soul rolls. We just gotta start rolling them. There aren't any block right now. You make room for more cards, you know? Speaking of, we're just gonna draw more cards now. It's not doing any damage. We're ripping some of this stuff. We're doing something. There we go. That looks better. Twenty-seven times two, flying sleep coming in. Why is it twenty-seven? Free strength. Enter divinity. Die next turn. So wait, you. This is the last turn. Lose energy starting next turn. That's totally fine. I mean, we're spending zero for this. It's like it costs one, a, a delayed one. Um, but how are we gonna handle? Remember, I got rid of all my block. 
Yeah, me neither. Two blocks for every card in your hand. I should have used that earlier. Wait, shit, what was that? Put three random attack from your draw pile into your hand. <laughs> I have one card on my draw. No. Start of your turn, die. I'm waiting. Oh, the start of her turn. It shouldn't matter what we do now. It sh she should just be dead. Just in case. Just in case. Beep, 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 She likes to cheat death. That's... That's kind of on, uh... That's kind of on the downfall team's... Bad. There. That, that That's just not truthful. They could have written in there, warning, doesn't die. That There's no way that's intentional. I'm just gonna call it. Like I see it. Bullshit. Nip. I just wasted all my fucking energy because I was like, it's over. We don't have to care anymore. I should just not use these cards. So let's just wait. Save energy. Oh, that's a lot of damage coming in. Definitely got to weaken. Defend, defend. And should have used that first. Really. We're hanging in there. But she's going to enter divinity. So. Are we hanging in there? Ragnarok coming in. So if I fight her... Let's see here. Watcher will lose four strength when she next enters Divinity. She's not entering Divinity right now, so she shouldn't be doing double damage on the Ragnarok. We should be okay. Maybe. Bunch of trash. Here. Use that. That's pretty good. Soul roll this. Tail whip. Defensive. Snake rake. Strike. Probably soul roll that blood for blood. That's good enough. And we're good. My hand is full. Maybe she only turns divinity once since she already did that. It's all block. Oops, all block. Start sending it then.
Gotta make room for more stuff. Finally got death certificate in Binding of Isaac. Very nice. Very nice. Okay, looks like we probably got a killer here. Do, 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 do. Ooh, good one. Well, we didn't kill her. Could use that earlier. I keep doing that. I, I see the picture, and I think it goes with the card that I know it from, which is the draw. It's the skim, which is draw like three cards. I'm like, great, I'll just save that to the end. And then I look at it, and then I realize that the downfall team's like, ah, oh, we'll just steal some shit. Throw it on other cards. It's kind of a bum. Kind of a bum bum. Made it more expensive. There we go. <laughs> oh, I didn't even need that much block. We just, I don't know. We're having fun with it, I guess. Whatever. Easy. Problem with memorizing card graphics. Subconsciously, though. It's not like I'm actively trying to do that. Card card. Choose a card. Then transform your hand into that card's class. Interesting. Or a rare attack. Rare attack. Hey, how about a second runic pyramid? Double effectiveness of oceans or house. Bum 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 bum. I've never had the option of getting two relics that were the same before, but here we are. I like this path here. More shop. Morb shop. Any of these that we really, really like. Um, I thought the irritability was pretty good. Show of hands could be good if I remembered what it was. Smith, maybe one of these master eyes. Maybe the soul rolls. Sure. Double a potion affecting me hella OP. I'm gonna try to hit one of these spiky guys. Maybe I will. They're just such a pain late game if you don't go on, get them uh, early. Gremlin Offensive just keeps giving you Gremlin Offensives until you run out of energy. Which could be good with ice cream, but Dagger Dance is going to get me killed. I guess Armaments. Master Eye Plus. Didn't really need to do that. I should have kept those. Got a little carried away. Block in there. Steel Edge, Berserk combo, deal 9 damage, X times, defensive combo. I think we're defensive. Gain 8 block, X times. We're just going to need a whole lot of defense if we're going to try to kill these spikers. And I just, uh, I don't, uh, oh, I do. Uh, oh. 
I mean, ugh. we don't have that much defense, you know. I hate you. Why are you like this? You don't have to be like this. Why are you making wide stink more expensive? This is nice though. I can get this guy. Be nice. Be nice. Dog fan prime sub. Thank you for that. I think you just trash it. You trash. 31 damage, but I don't have any block. But I get some block this way. Defensive combo. Gain 8 block. Why do I have to target somebody? You're in defensive. That was confusing. Got him. Nice. Snake sap. I like that one a lot. Pretty good with ice cream. Alright. End the shop guy. Now's the time. Now's the time, you bastard. I hate it. Thanks. What did we just use? Strike. How's the stream been? Pretty good. Quit calling me Shirley. Five temp HP, I guess. Oh, oh, oh. Give me more cards. God, you're bad. You're so bad to me. Murder strike. You just retain it and just gains more damage when you use skills. Awful. Just five block on 20 damage. I guess we had the other five temp HP. Limb Glam, what do you got? Plus 28, very nice. We're Berserker Stance, so we're gonna do 10 extra damage with this precise thrust. Snake Sap first. Got a bunch of um, energy. Thrust him. Thrust him if you must him. Soul Roll. Master Eye, more expensive. Wow, that was zero cost. Don't you know that be here for I don't think so we're gonna get him. Tell a couple jokes and enjoy the view. I'll be here for you. Don't you know that maybe though? Got him. Seven hundred and thirty souls. Unidentified upgraded ironclad card. Could be good. Unidentified common skill card. This will try it. I'll give it a go. Put an attack card from your draw pile under your hands. Uh, yeah. No. More paints. Draw a pile, you view them in order. Uh, maybe we should just spend everything? I don't know. Start your turn, deal three damage to all enemies. 
Next two cards are played twice. Play the top six cards of your draw pile. Go. Card removal. A strike. 700 down the drain, just like that. There is another shop coming up that I suppose we could have hit. A couple different options, but... Dark your hourglass builds up. Deal a surprising amount of damage. So many soul rolls. Probably should pop one of these potions before we have to get rid of one of them. Skills cost zero whenever you play a skill, exhaust it. Damage equal to your body. This is so good, too. A body slam. I'm gonna block. Defense. Body slam plus doesn't really matter, I guess, when it comes back. If it comes back, it'd be good to have. Shield throw. It's basically the same thing. Nice. And then we get nothing. We just basically have to die. Unless we bite him. 50 counter? Sorry, liquid luck. You're an eight. Boot to here. A boot and a boot. When in doubt, double down. Polish. Shiv's deal. Additional three damage. Wards grant three additional block. Awaken. When you would die or at the end of combat, heal 12. Fresh river. Oh, when we hit him, we're going to get that spike in our face. I could use that on Spirit Guardian, but three strength is going to block it via the artifact. Turds! Disarm you, maybe. Because I'm going to try to kill this guy quickly. This is going to be blocked. Do that. Be out, drawing off the cup. One look, and I make this bitch rub. And I got a sweet tooth for a little slut. Yeah. You see, every day, I, I polish still, so maybe. For your turn, lose one HP and draw one card. Deal seven damage to all enemies. Trigger skill bonuses. Now I'm gonna go infinite blocks. Infinite blocks with polish. It sounds nice. Neck bite. I need to get this bloater immediately. Like now ish. Got like 30 damage coming in here, 20 damage coming in here, 4 damage coming in there. Yikes. Gonna need more fucking luck. Yeah. Oh, give me a block. Eight block. Weak? Weak might be... No, it's not because this guy's going to block it. But if, if I did shockwave him, at least I'd get rid of both of his stupid things. Oh, yeah. Shock it off. Snake sap for sure. I touch this spike trap, it gives me five damage. Not what I want in my life. Dramatic entrance and wide sting are both gonna hit the spike. More expensive defensive player. That's that's what I wanted. Thank you for that. Block. Okay. 
The Spirit Guardian is tough. So freaking tough. The fact that we have four frail right now, it's like... like what are we doing? Get him. Just start working on that stupid stuff. Put the stuff in the thing with the place, the guy. Rotation, discard all off cost cards. Discard our dramatic entrance, please. Yeah, that's pretty good. Really expensive wide stain now. By 50 counter. Do it. Frickin' do it. Cablamo. Start of my turn. So if I just did get a block on, wait it off, hourglass him. Random two cost card sounds pretty good. Sounds pretty good. Uh, Crash the treasure has always been nice to us. Drawing more cards could be really good. I'm going to go to two cost though. And he lives nine strength this turn exhaust. You will probably wait on that. Tail whip, wide sting, fairy dust plus. Battle plan. Four block, five scry. These are all good. I like them. Thanks. I gotta get rid of something here. Maybe there are wards. Increases our murder strike damage too if I do get him out of here. Crash the treasure something, maybe our dice block since it's so expensive. Snake sap, bunch of energy. Uppercut, too weak, too vulnerable. I like it. Serpents. Target enemy gains one strength, but then I gain 12 vigor, which gives me 12 more attack. I hate it. Seven block, two temp strength. Nine block, nine counter. Finisher, though. We do have the ability to get into stances, I suppose. Oh, sure. All right. Now he's going to do super strong attacks. Defensive stance again. 47 damage here on this murder strike, but we got to go higher than that. Those are rookie numbers. In one strength go. Yeah. 
69 health. First time you play a combo each turn, return it to your hand. It costs zero until played. I don't think we have any combo cards. Literally have zero combo cards. Thanks. Uh, play the power card just to get rid of it. We literally have like no block at all. It's very concerning. Top six cards are next two cards are played twice. 88. This is not going to be enough. Top six cards go. Random bullshit go. It worked. Is it card to discard? Um, we're scrying. Okay. That'll do. How much are you doing now? 151 from... If I did the next, if I did the duplication potion, we could just finish this fight right now. But I think I'm going to need that later. Maybe. Possibly. I don't know. Do you know where that reference is from? Which reference? Boom, 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 boom. All right. Keep it up. Random BS go, isn't it? Moon Knight? Comic? Correct. Test me. You trying to test me right now? I need to keep these defense cards. I, what do I do? I scry, I guess. It's expensive, but... We don't need defensive shout. We don't need defensive shout. Draw cards is good. Defend and wide sting. Say, so, yeah, sure. I think you'll need to rip the soul rolls. Yeah, we're just not filling up our hand enough. I mean, we're hanging in there. It's not not winning. I probably should have ripped defense cards first. I don't know because you attack. You want to attack later on, but. Down, down, up, and with the down, and another 299 fucking damage. And up, and up, and up, and up, and up, and up. Anchor's good. Upgraded block card. Honestly, like, we have enough block, I think. We got a lot of block. Unidentified strength card. Let's just go champ. Champ me. If we don't play an attacks, we gain extra energy. That's pretty good. We want to go probably wide over here through our shop again. I think uppercut's pretty good here. The too weak, too vulnerable. I liked it. We could lock it in. We could also just upgrade more Master Eye for more card draw, but that hasn't really been stopping us. We could try to upgrade more of our Soul Rolls so we get more card draw. Upgrade our Serpent's Idol so it's free. Yeah, do that. 
keep the murder strike. Start each combat with on one artifact. That's going to stop us from the first time we try to confuse, confuse ourselves, but... We're going to end up ripping our own artifact if that's the case. Still, maybe... Maybe worth it? See what happens. Actually, go back. Um, buy a potion, maybe. Our potion. Go. Oh, wait. I'm at 49? You're shitting on my neck. 49 is 50. What is this, Gungeon? You're so full of shit. 1 to 31 damage. What do artifacts do? It blocks the first debuff that I get. Deal 12 damage whenever you would gain block this turn. Instead, deal that much damage. Yeah, we can. Yeah, okay, I, that's fine. You already got him. Two vulnerable sounds really nice, but we don't have the ability to do a finisher. Four damage, gain one ship for each deck. Whiz. Mm, that's bad. I hate it. It's honestly wait. Twenty damage if they intend to attack. Sure. Tail Whip first. I can honestly hold on to Tail Whip. It's a really good card. Waits for him to be hitting for 60 before we Tail Whip for the Weaken as well. See if we can't catch up without having to do that. Yep. Yeah, that's correct. I probably should have gotten rid of refreshments since it's kind of trash, but. How have you been, Dad? I'm, I'm well. Feeling good. So I'm going to Master Eye and I'm going to block my own confusion. Yeah. That is what happens. Refreshment. Berserker combo. Gain three energy. Hey. That's actually. That was, that was nice. I'm glad we kept it. If we go ahead and make sure that either our Bash or Tail Whip is the only card left, we can guaranteed madness it. Tail Whip. Let's... This one does more damage, so let's hit him with Bash first. And Tail Whip. Good thing I kept it, huh? Might be in trouble in this next one, though. At least we got some money. We didn't get any money. Whenever you gain block, deal seven damage. Yes. Like, I'm gonna pull that card first. Oh. There it is. Soul roll it? No. Ow. God. Awful. Oh. Oh, no. Fine though, we, we made it. Got him. Have you guys ever killed this guy? I've killed him once. Once in my life. I think Juggernaut's pretty okay. Ash is pretty okay. 
Taco Jugs. Did you win Vampire Survivors yet? How many deaths is that? 130, 140 deaths? How is it still going? Finding a mini boss before the final final boss, probably a mistake here, but get a bunch of souls we'll never spend. Don't hurt me, please. Ah, damn it. Up hurting me. What is this song? Bamf by Pegboard Nerds. Duh. When you get him on one that you like, you should just let him go. Just leave it. I don't want to be vulnerable, but... Ah, Jesus. It's going to get me another curse. Last 10. Once you get below 50% HP, remove all debuffs and gain 6 strength. Well, that's not going to be very helpful, but goodbye. Get out of here. Go on now. I ain't got no block. What if I just go ahead and accept the goddamn curse so I don't die? Regolo, thank you so much for the 23 months. Welcome back. Shit! Ass! See? I'd rather be cursed. Better. Uh, yeah. Uh, uh, yep. Panash. Panash is really good. Not attack cards. Gain seven block per. That's gonna exhaust my soul rolls. And I don't know if I want to do that. But maybe. But maybe. But maybe not. No. Vulnerable to me again, though. Pair of crush is an easy one, yes. Hmm. Prompt. Late night stream, let's go. It's up on us. Hmm, juggies. Don't like this. And what's going on with this? Snake sap. I needed that energy, thank you. Nope to you. Add one random colorless card to your hand. It was a madness. I need a little bit of this. A little bit of that. A little bit of that. A little bit of that. Zayz is back. What's up? Invincible. 
can only lose 10 HP. Plus two card draw. Okay, 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 okay. You cannot get spanked. This is a mustn't spank right now. We need to get uh, the weakness. No, but yes. That's the one. That's the one. Soul roll it now. No. You gonna work with me? No. You're. Oh my fucking god. Are you kidding me? This is the biggest joke I've ever seen in my entire life. The biggest joke. I just use the goddamn card. Apply one week if the enemy has three or more weak gain ten block. Body slam is nice though. Shield throw, pretty much the same. Deal damage equal to your block twice. Gain two frail. Uh, I gain frail. Defensive combo, don't gain frail. Two then three then two then three. I just uh, the the fucking luck that I've seen today. I like a lot of these things. I like a lot of these things. Money? No. See, now I'm just tempted to... I, I don't know. I don't know what I'm tempted to do. Rip the tail whip immediately. Weaken him. I, I need more block is what I need. Not it. It's only going to give me one block. Going into the final boss with whatever health we get here. Do you have three or more whiz? No, I don't. More weak. Enemy is weak. Gain more block. What do we got going on here? We want to probably body slam him, but... Lobber, maybe best saved. Oh, we weren't even in a stance. I was like, that could give us two more cards, but no. This is horrible. This is awful. You're the worst. You are literally the fucking worst, and I hate you, and I hope that you, that you feel pain. I want you to feel pain. This is what I want. Can't even hit him with my body slam right now. Because he's got the intangible every other turn. where we got to hit him the hardest. Boom. 
another power potion. Just let me get to the boss! You're being a douche. Stop doing that. Fresh to treasure? No. No. I do not think so, no. Remove the enemy's block and artifact. Kill 13 damage. Shatter plus. Kill that guy. Nail whip for some weak, maybe. Off the card, gain a random card of the same class. Fairy dust could be good. We'll let it live for now. Better than Gambit, you're just a burden right now. Exhaust your hand, deal 11 damage for each card exhausted. Well, I would definitely kill one of them. But it gets rid of all of our stuff that we have saved up. The juggernaut at first. Why don't I juggernaut first? What am I even doing? I'm left of nine freaking strength. And the combat heal 12 HP. Hmm. First time you use a finisher each turn, gain. No, it's bad. He's awake in next turn, I guess. Can read those heals, though. Sixty-three health. Oh, so damn so heavy. The start of your turn, gain an impending doom with retain. At the end of your turn, deal 13 damage to everyone if it's in the middle. Dead on effect. So if it's in the middle, uh, impending doom automatically activates. Should be pretty okay given our runic pyramid. We should be pretty safe. Unless we use all of our cards. I'm going to go ahead and power potion. Mud shield. I need you in my life. Start of your turn, gain an echo of soul roll. Though. God, unlimited rolls is like the card that I needed like this entire time. Mud Shield is going to be a winner, though. Um, I feel like I should just double up on all of the Mud Shields. Duplication both Mud Shields. Start of each turn, gain a random off glass card and more Mud Shields. I want all of the Mud Shields, damn it. Mud my shields. 
Yeah, bud. Try me! You will lose. Enter Berserker, gain six blocks, six vigor. Sure. Choose an attack or a power card. Add a copy of that card into your hand. Hmm. How many mods are you running today? Just the one, just the downfall. Maybe dual wield here. I can see myself having fun with that. So if I soul roll like this, boom, we gain tons of block. Okay, Impending Doom is in the middle, but we can handle it. Baby, it's the small things keeping me up at night. If I snack proof the un un impending doom, it probably just gives me a different curse. Maybe I'm fine with it? I don't know. Do that and we're safe. We're fine. It's gonna weaken me though and make me vulnerable. 19 damage and 9 damage coming in. Soul roll. I suppose it is not soul roll, but if I did soul roll, that's pretty good. Double tap. Double attack. I could save it, or I could send it. Oh, some serious damage right there. Some serious block. Impending Doom 1, go. Blocked it all, baby. We're crushing it. This is what I like to see. Game's immediately gonna kill me off now, though. I said that. It, it was really all about the mud shields and the soul roll. That sounds kind of nice. Give me some more energy. I don't know how the impending doom got here in the middle, but looks like that's gonna go off again. Eventually. Because Iron Fang is just a, it's a great card. It's uh, dealing damage to everybody though, so as long as we block the impending doom, and we're just dealing damage to the hermit. Rope a dope. Gain 12 block. Next turn, gain energy and draw two cards. Well, as you rope my dope. Crash a treasure, one of these defend cards, since it's expensive. Draw two cards, put one on top of my hand. It's fine. You got nothing but curses this turn. Twenty-seven damage coming in. Juggernaut. I like the idea of Juggernaut. Twenty M Hunt is still alive. Double impending doom. <laughs> they just put it in the middle. You can't just cheat. You're not supposed to just put it in the middle. Oh, you know, I think I actually pulled those. You're full of shit. Ooh, I was gonna dual wield my dice boulder, but now I'm gonna dual wield my tail whip. Double action. That's hot. You're dead. You're super dead. That's it. Easy. That was a that was a better Sneko run. And we got the upgrade, the tr uh, the artifacts. Rare booster box. Upon pickup, obtain an unidentified rare card of each type. 
Ooh. At the start of each combat, gain a pure luck with retain. I don't know what a pure luck is. Muddled cards cannot cost three. Those are good. I like those. Oh, we got minus one point for being poopy. That's a cool run. I like that one a lot. Let me know your thoughts in the comment section down below. Uh, do you want more of this? I, I enjoy it. I play the Spire. I play it offline all the time. So if you guys want to see me play more Slay the Spire, then uh, pick up. Like I said, thanks for watching. See you in the next one.